Here we're going to solve uh, differential equations that uh, are asked in this form. Um, it says find values of r so that y is equal to x to the r solves the differential equation and then here's the differential equation. So what we need to do is we need to find, uh, we need to get these y's into forms that we can plug in here. Since we go up to uh, y double prime, we need to get this y up to double prime as well. Um, so we can start off saying y is equal to x to the r. Um, and then we'll go ahead and say y uh, prime is equal to um, r x uh, to the r minus 1. So we'll just bring that down and make this r minus 1. Um, y double prime, uh, we'll do the same thing again, um, is going to be equal to r times r minus 1 x to the r minus 2. And then we can we can bring this in there and uh, this ends up being r squared um, so bring that into these two things r squared minus r um, and that's going to be times x to the r minus 2. Okay so now we have y prime we have y, uh, y double prime, y, y prime, and we have y by itself. <clears throat> so now we need to substitute these into this equation up here, and then we can solve it. So we'll go ahead. Um, so x squared y double prime is going to be x squared, and here's the y double prime equation. And so that's going to be r squared minus r times x to the r minus 2. Okay, and then uh, we go to the second part right here, and this is 2x y prime, so we use our y prime equation. So that's going to be 2x times r x to the r minus 1, and then we have a negative 2y, so minus 2 times y is x to the r. Okay. So now we have this big long equation and that's going to be equal to zero. So now we just need to simplify this and then we can uh, reduce it down to find out what r is, which is the, the main goal of this. So once we simplify, we come out to um, r squared plus r minus three, x to the r is equal to zero. And then uh, from this, we can uh, factor out this equation right here. Um, so this ends up becoming r plus 2 and r minus 1. So we find out that r is equal to negative 2 and r is equal to positive 1. Now I didn't go through and, um, and simplify all this stuff. Um, but if you do that on your own, that's what you'll get is, is this equation right here. You want to separate out the, uh, the r's and then this is x to the to the r but this this is what's going to give you this this factorable uh two equations right here um so there you go this is this is your final answer right here